Lynn Hudsonville. Today is Tuesday, January 18th. I'm Alicia. And I'm Liv. And here are your announcements. Remember the meeting for sophomores is today during seminar to answer all questions that might come up in regards to the Tech Center application process. Applicants for sophomore and junior students who are interested in attending CareerLine Tech Center for the 2022-2023 school year are now open. Applications will be evaluated after the February 11th deadline and are not based on a first-come, first-served basis. Attention AM Tech Center students and parents. Please do not drop off students in the Freshman Campus bus loop. The bus loop is only for buses and staff parking. For the safety of our bus drivers, students, and staff, please use the other drop-off areas on campus, not the bus loop. The Never Forgotten Game Week is here. We will be selling t-shirts for $10 at lunch all week. There will also be games for a dollar and cookies for a dollar. Fire up for the basketball game versus Granville on Friday. Sign up to hear from our creative and performing arts speaker, Adam Locker, during Career Connections on Thursday, January 20. Check your student email for the sign-up form. Are you 16 or older? Do you want to save three lives? Check your email to sign up to give blood this Friday, January 21st. If you have questions, email Frau Wedge. Mr. Henney needs some help. If you're planning on joining the service upon graduation, please contact Mr. Henney. Boys Volleyball Open Gym is tonight in the freshman campus from 6 to 8. Be there. After falling behind 10 to 0, the girls bowling team rallied for a big victory against Rockford last night. The girls were led by Morgan Blau and Tana Barr. Unfortunately, the boys bowling team lost a close one to Rockford by four points. And here's Emma with the lunch. Good morning, Hudsonville. Today for lunch, we're going to be having something I think is a little bit new. We're going to be having some apple cinnamon Texas toast along with scrambled eggs and my favorite, potato cubes. Okay, I think I'm going to try this. I'm hoping it's pretty good. And tomorrow for lunch, we're going to be having the deli sandwich bar. And usually for this, I just put a lot of mayo on my sandwich, and it's pretty good. Thanks. And here are your birthdays for Tuesday, January 18th. And here's an announcement for the Never Forgotten Game. Attention Hutchinville High School. I have some news for you up regarding an upcoming event, Friday, January the 21st. We have our annual Never Forgotten Basketball Game against the Granville Bulldogs. And there's some fundraising that's coming up. So it's $1 for all these events, but it's for all lunches. Uh, Tuesday, we have Ring Toss at the main campus as well. Wednesday, we have We at the Freshman Campus. Can go. Uh, Thursday, we have 10 seconds for 10 questions at the main campus. And then Friday, we have Free Throw Friday at the main campus. So pay a dollar, go shoot some free throws, and maybe uh, you'll be on the basketball team too. Uh, also, Wednesday through Friday, we're selling cookies at both campuses. That'll be $1. And shirts are $10, so get those before they're gone too. Those will be at all campuses uh, every day. Get those before it's gone and come support our basketball team Friday against the Granville Bulldogs. Thank you. And now to Ethan to evaluate some student parking. Hi students and staff, I'm Ethan Grundahl and today I'm going to look at bad parking. And to start off, we're going to look at this car. Just look at it. Not even in the lines, in fact, parked on the lines and not to mention staff parking. What, what, what are you doing? What are you doing? Okay, I get it. There's some snow right here. But you still got plenty of room to where you don't need to be parking on the line. What is, what is with these people? According to my calculations, this is not how you park. C clearly on the line, doesn't know how to park at all. <laughs> don't park on the grass. And those are your announcements for Tuesday, January 18th. Have a great day.